This is Twit. Now, hover conversion kits for your vehicle have always been part of the dream of the future, right? At least for Marty McFly it was. But what if I told you there will soon be autonomous vehicle conversion kits coming to a city near you? Well, a new startup called Ghost Locomotion, which emerged this week from a stealth with once with actually sixty three point seven million dollars in investment from Founders Fund, Coastal Ventures and Sutter Hill Ventures is actually targeting your vehicle. Now, Ghost is developing a kit that will allow privately owned passenger vehicles to drive autonomously on highways. Now, there's the key there, highways. And the company says it will deliver it by 2020. Now, a price has not been set, but the company says it will be less than Tesla's charges for its autopilot package that includes full self-driving or FSD. Now, FSD currently costs around $7,000, so this kit isn't going to give a vehicle superiorly, superior advanced driving assistance, but the kit will let human drivers hand control of their vehicle over to a computer, allowing them to do other activities such as look at their phone or even doze off. Oof. Sounds a little scary there. Now, there are other competitors in the market that also are trying to do this work, like Comma AI. But Ghost feels they have a different approach to this. They want to first solve the problem of vehicles driving on freeways and highways, not just on local roads like some of the other competitors. Now, automakers have continued to make progress in advanced driver assistance systems. Now, the more advanced versions of these systems provide the SAE, as SAE describes, as level two automation, which means they have two primary control functions uh, that are automated. Now, Tesla's autopilot system is a good example of this tech. Now, Ghost wants to take the human out of the loop when they're driving on highways. Now, the kit involves hardware-like sensors and a computer that's installed on in the trunk and connected to the controller area network or the CAN of the vehicle. The CAN is essentially the bus, and it's it's the nervous system of the car, and it allows various parts of the commu- to communicate together. Now, Ghost's entire approach is based on an axiom that the human driver is fundamentally correct. It begins by collecting a mass amounts of video data with kits that are installed in the cars of high mileage drivers. Now, Ghost then uses the models to figure out what's going on in the scene and combines that with other data, including the person is driving by measuring and the actions that they take. Now, this is a different way of thinking about the problem. Now, they use actually real-world telemetry data to develop real models of human situations and mechanical approaches to solving problems. Who knows? You might see autonomous conversion kits coming soon to an auto shop near you.